it's really is the most golden, most delicious, delectable. And we're very proud of our, of our herring eggs and I've never seen anybody thumb their nose at a herring egg before and it's something that everybody loves to celebrate. My name is Anthony Lindoff. I am the traditional food security manager for Tlingit and Haida. Traditional food security to me means providing and reconnecting our, to our traditional ways and our, and our lands. We are purchasing 14,000 pounds um, from tribal citizen permit holders and 100% of that row on kelp is going to be distributed to our tribal citizens. So we're working on our herring pond nets, making sure there's no holes, working on our seines, making sure they're ready to go, working on our herring pens. It takes about a month pre-work. So here's how I've always looked at herring eggs. We've got through another tough winter and this is like our New Year's. This isn't January. This is our true New Year's, I believe. All the hard times we've endured all winter long, everything just kind of gets released. All, all the stress, everybody comes together as one. And that's when we all sit around, we're eating, telling stories, and life's good. Life is really good. We're pretty unique. We, we live in a very unique uh, environment that, and not too many people get to um, have access to this to this lifestyle and it's something that um, is really near and dear to my heart and something this way of life and this um, is, is very much something that I I aim to protect and uh, safeguard for, for future generations. The first time I ever harvested was a couple of years ago and honestly uh, it was a it was an amazing experience getting out there to, to pick and find uh, kelp and I think it was really the first time I, I just felt rich. You know, it was the only way I could really explain it. I don't know what even any fish eggs like this before. It is very much a social um, event and you bust out your best hooligan oil or your best seal grease and you, you get your aunties and uncles together and the little ones and everybody just has a great time around the table. I think those are memories that um, last a lifetime and you can't replicate or bottle up and package. It's something that you have to just live and experience and those experiences I'm thinking are just that's what really um, gets me up in the morning and makes me really in love my job. Is there any more left? This is it. We tried to give uh, four or five pounds per household and just one of those yeah. blades was probably close to that anyways so it was uh, people were extremely happy making sure everybody gets some, you know, and that's it's really important. Whether we're Tlingit or Haida or Simshian or village or urban, I think food security is something that we can all agree on and something that um, that we all want to contribute to. So the product that we'll be distributing that 14,000 pounds um, throughout 21 communities and over 3,600 households. Not one pound, not one ounce of that is for sale. That is all for free distribution to our tribal citizens. This is our Juno Clinton Haida Community Center. We're breaking the kelp down to a size that is gonna be able to be placed into the gallon size bags. My name is Rhonda Butler. I'm Juno Clinkett and Haida Community Council President. This is definitely supporting our subsistence way of life. This is um, a, a gem. This is a golden egg. It's a little past Easter, but this is our golden egg for our, for our tribal citizens for sure. This is a delicacy. And some Rowan kelp. All right, come on up. <laughs> Appreciate you sporting with us and all right. Well, thank you very much, and you stay safe. You, can, you can't make it down to Sitka, it's just cost prohibitive. This is awesome. And on, yeah. on kelp, oh my gosh, on kelp, yeah. my goodness, yeah. Thank you guys so much. We might be at a thousand bags. Some of our elders will just rinse it right off and eat it like just like this. Um, others they will pickle it. Um, you can 
also dip it into the hot boiling water. I like using butter or seal oil. Either plain or uh, butter and soy sauce. <laughs> I like them in salad or just just eat them. <laughs> mm. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> Thank you. Bye.